updates in the Gator Wrestling Club. Interesting matchup will come to the mat here and mat number one at 55 kilos. It'll be four time world champion Anna Gomez of France taking on two time world bronze medalist Tatiana Padilla of the United States and Sunkiss Kids. Now, when we say four time world champion, the last time Gomez won a world championship was back in 1999. So 12 years ago, she was a world champion. She was an Olympic bronze medalist in 2008 and also was a bronze in 2010, but obviously did not face Padilla. Gomez is 37. Padilla is 20. So a 17-year age difference between the two wrestlers on the mat. Again, both bronze medalists in 2010. Gomez first won a world championship in 1993 when Padilla was three years old. No score here in the early going. Padilla reaching for the leg. Nothing doing there. 40 gone by. Condor in control with a one-point lead over Engelhart over on three. Padilla trying to force the action on the edge. Condor in control and will win the first period over on mat three. Slide by attempt for Padilla. Under a minute to go. We are scoreless in the semifinals at 55, 121. There's the reach for Padilla. In on the double is Gomez trying to sprawl as Padilla. Now facing, countering with the front headlock, trying to spin behind. Spins behind, needs to clear her arm as her older, as her shoulder rather. Referee telling Gomez to open up, so Padilla will get a one-point takedown and take the lead. Now tries to work for a gut wrench. Trying to load to the near side, switching directions. About elbow deep, and we'll come back up to our feet with 19 seconds to go. Second period underway with Engelhart and Condor. That is over on three. First period coming to a close. Two and one, Gomez on the attack. Padilla got a counter, time runs out, and Padilla will win the first period, 1-0. Over four-time world champion, Anna Gomez of France. Condor in control over there on two, has to watch herself though. Now up 3-0. Gives up the takedown, or the reversal in this case. Now 5-1, Condor in the lead over on three. We're in the break here on mat one. So far, our finalists are set at 48 kilos. We're to be Carol Wynn of Canada, Ivana Matkowska of Poland. A couple world medalists going to duke it out at 48. Jessica McDonald of Canada into the finals already with her victory over Miranda Dick. It's 1-0-7-0. And Condor with a four-point lead over on three. Scoreless here in the early going on. Mat number one in period two between Tatiana Padilla of the United States and Anna Gomez of France. Condor again with a takedown over there on the far mat with 40 to go. Gomez trying to force some action. That slide by attempt by Padilla, which he's actually very, very good at. Reaching for the ankle is Gomez. 45 gone by here in period two. There's that slide by again. Nearly cannot. Nearly finishes. Now snapping with the front headlock. Reaching for the near ankle. Tries to clear her elbow. Now coming behind. And gets the takedown. So a one-point lead for Padilla. She goes to look like she's setting up a lace. Decides against that idea. 
Now tries to shelf the leg and looks like she was going for the lace as we call for a restart. 47 to go. 6-2, your winner over on three. So into the finals, Whitney Condor of the United States with the victory at 51. She will take on Jessica McDonald of Canada. Solid effort there for Condor, the Washington native, the resident athlete here at the Olympic Training Center. Tatiana, again, front headlocks, snap, spin, go behind. So a 2-0 lead. Now tries to go with that lace, at least tries to set it up a little bit. Now working up to the waist. We'll go back up to our feet with 15 to go. Helen Maroulis of the United States. Stepping to the mat to take on Tonya Verbeek of Canada on mat three. Verbeek 33, Maroulis 19. And Tatiana Padilla with a 3-0 second period victory and will advance to the finals at 55, where she will await the winner of the Marulis and Verbeek bout.